Bobby Lashley is finally your WWE Champion after defeating The Miz last night on Monday Night Raw. It has been many years in the making and it's great to see Bobby Lashley holding up that WWE Championship. Like I said, I've wanted to see this since 2007. Uh, it's great that we finally get to see it. 14 years later in 2021. What I thought was an entertaining storyline uh, throughout the night on Raw last night with The Miz. The cowardly Miz trying to escape at all costs to eventually be thrown into a, a lumberjack match where, let's be fair, it was a glorified squash match as well. Miz is hated that much. Not even the, not even the Hills wanted to help him out. And Bobby Lashley, like I say, now crowned the champion, holding up the championship and pointing at the WrestleMania sign. You love to see it, but I tell you what, where I see a win for Bobby Lashley, I see an opportunity to do some fantasy booking. So many people assume that we know the direction for WrestleMania, that Bobby Lashley would perhaps defend the championship against Drew McIntyre. I'm wondering if the path is going to be slightly altered, especially after Brock Lesnar was trending last night on Twitter after Raw went off the air. And I do know that Bobby Lashley has wanted that dream match with Brock Lesnar for many years. In fact, he has claimed previously, apparently, that he's been promised that match at some point down the line when he re-signed with WWE back in 2018. Now, we've been through it all before. Bobby Lashley, he's overcome a lot since coming back. He's pointed at his bum. He's shown off his sisters. But now, thanks to MVP and the Hurt Business being the most legitimate thing on Raw, the Hurt Business, honestly, it's put Lashley on a different level. I see the fire in his eyes. There's a monster in Bobby Lashley. There is an animal waiting inside. An almighty error has begun. And I tell you what, I think that match against Drew McIntyre, the start of this fantasy booking, is not going to take place at WrestleMania. No, because Drew McIntyre said he's coming for the champion. He wants to go in as champion at WrestleMania. We've got Fastlane before on Peacock, the first pay-per-view that's going to be on Peacock as well, uh, replacing the WWE Network in the States. They're going to want to do a big match, a big angle, and go in with a bang. So this is my prediction here for this. I think that match between Lashley and Drew is put on this show, and what people have been dreaming about is that Brock Lesnar makes a return to WWE and actually causes a no-contest finish, creating a triple threat match at WrestleMania. Now, you may turn around and say at WrestleMania, the big stumbling block here is that, well, Maybe we don't want Drew in the mix, but perhaps WWE, you know, probably feels a bit sorry for the situation Drew McIntyre's been in. He waited 18 years to get his WrestleMania moment, and he had to win the championship inside the Performance Center. Drew McIntyre even said on Raw he's been defending it every which way since, in the Thunderdome, in the PC, and now, I mean, Drew McIntyre, he's held the title for most of the year to fall at the finish line. It feels a bit of a shame that Drew McIntyre probably wouldn't get his moment in front of fans. And perhaps WWE would want to give that moment to him. The only thing is that I assume that at this point, maybe fans might be getting a bit tired of Drew McIntyre. There seems to be a lot of support when he lost the championship to The Miz. Who I think, by the way, just to mention The Miz, I think he goes back to the Bad Bunny program. I don't see him in the championship picture whatsoever from here on out. If he's lucky, he may get a quick rematch on Raw. But anyway, to go into WrestleMania, I think perhaps WWE could find a way of giving Drew that moment where it's not going to hurt Lashley so much. Because let's look at Lashley. He has not lost. He's lost one match since Backlash last year, um, you know, with his shoulders being pinned to the mat. And that was a fluke as well. And uh, when he lost the United States Championship, he actually wasn't even involved in the decision. Lashley, like I said, is on a different level. And at WrestleMania, if Drew was to pin Brock, then that always gives Drew that moment in front of fans. But it also gives a legitimate gripe for Bobby Lashley to go back for the championship. Where that way you could turn around and say that at the next pay-per-view, whether it's Money in the Bank, Backlash, Payback, what's ever on the WWE calendar, whatever they've got in mind, Bobby Lashley could actually beat Drew McIntyre clean. And then Drew McIntyre can go to the upper mid-card for the time being. A strong babyface and a very well-booked babyface, my ad. But the reign of the almighty could go through the entire summer as WWE champion. So that's my almost fantasy booking slash prediction of what I think is to come. We're probably going to learn very quickly what will be coming up in the head for Bobby Lashley and Drew McIntyre leading into WrestleMania. And will Brock Lesnar be involved? Like I said, fans are going to be at WrestleMania this year. Brock was in an empty PC last year. We haven't seen him since. Maybe there is just that opportunity that he would come back for this WrestleMania if the money, the deal, the match is right. And for me, I don't know about you, but Drew McIntyre, Bobby Lashley and Brock Lesnar as a triple threat match at WrestleMania just sounds epic. 
I really want to see it. Let me know. Do you want to see that match in the comments below? Maybe you want to see Lashley retain in that environment. Maybe you just want Lashley versus Brock Lesnar. Well, let me just say to finish and round this video off. I would have that match later this year as a one-on-one. -on -one. If you can get Brock in for WrestleMania, then I suggest you do Lashley versus Brock Lesnar at SummerSlam as your main event. That's what I would suggest could be a fancy booking idea, a prediction far ahead of what WWE could do. But that's what I think. It's now time to let me know what you think in the comments below. Are you happy to see Bobby Lashley as WWE Champion? Do you feel a little bit sorry for The Miz? I know there's a few of you out there that probably do. Um, do you think that it's going to be good that he'll be with Morrison against Bad Bunny and Damian Priest most likely at WrestleMania? Uh, do you think that Drew McIntyre should hold the championship, win it at WrestleMania? And do you think it'll be a one-on-one -on -one match between Drew McIntyre and Bobby Lashley? Or do you think the triple threat could go down? Let me know in the comments below right now. Looking forward to interacting with you. Check out other videos on the channel as well, including should WWE bring back the Cruiserweight Classic? That's a video I uploaded yesterday. Highly recommend you go and check it out now. And of course, Ask SCW is available on the channel as well. The biggest q and I've ever done in the series. Go and check it out right now. Some fantastic questions and thanks to everyone that got involved. But that's all from me. This is a quick upload for you here today, but there will be another video coming later today. If you're an AEW fan, that's right. AEW Revolution, the predictions are coming to the the channel and of course if you want to hear my thoughts of a monday night raw in full also i will be on Josie chats wrestling giving the raw review and you can go and check his channel out right now or what you could do you can also go to my playlist section where i get the newest uh involvement i do for monday night raw and Josie chats wrestling i put those on my playlist on the channel so you can just go there as well and you can check it out there but that's all for me anyway thank you for watching have yourselves a great day